All new for you this morning, a story more than a half a century in the making is now starting a happy new chapter. It all started with the adoption of a young child. As recently as 2019, nearly 140 people were adopted in New York State alone. About two in every five of those adoptions were for children ages 5 through 12. But how can children that young find their birth families? Well, Olivia Proya is bringing us a touching story of one Buffalo native who found her way home to her family after a long and trying search. An embrace more than 50 years in the making. Sisters born just one year apart, meeting for the first time. I feel so happy and over well. Knowing her has filled a void that I had inside of me for so, so long. My heart is just so warm right now. Um, you know, my mom did pass away, so this is just like, to me, it's just like, her just being the angel in heaven. Miriam Boone was adopted at just three years old. She didn't find out until she was 19. Now she's reunited with her birth family after nearly 20 years of searching. It started in 2003 when I um, registered with the adoption registry and then didn't hear anything until 2012 when um, I received a narrative about um, my adoption and my family, but nothing identifiable. In 2019, she submitted her DNA to 23andMe. And in January, she received her original birth certificate, learning her original name for the first time. In March, she matched with her uncle on 23andMe, only to learn her birth family had been searching for her the entire time. We did look for her, too. Um, this is before, you know, you have the 23 and what is it, 23 and me, uh -huh. and you know, ancestry and all those, um, um, tracing, you know, things. Um, so I'm just so happy that she, you know, did that. And to find out that I was actually looked for, I was actually wanted, that I was actually loved. It, like I said, it just filled a hole in my heart. It is just the best thing. The sisters say although they spent their entire lives apart, you'd never know from having the same college degree to the same exact phone. We're just going to keep our family bonding, you know, going and, and really, really get to know each other. We love her. Olivia Proya, Family 7 Eyewitness News.